So uh, how'd the race go for you? Definitely uh, was extremely difficult. Not, uh, you know, it didn't play out the way I'd like it to. Obviously, I would like to have a win, but Andy was the was the guy to beat. So I uh, I pushed as hard as I possibly could. Sat on his wheel for the the first two laps. Backed it down a little bit in the in the second lap. I think he was trying to recover for the third for the third lap. Um, at that point, I decided to to pick up the pace, keep some tension on his legs for the for about a quarter of the way into the third lap I got in front and just kept the pressure kept the pressure up for the whole rest of the race and then came down to a sprint going down the hill he sat behind me and jumped around started sprinting and he got the inside he got the inside of the cones on the bottom Ooh. on the bottom turn came but down to a sprint finish sprint finish without a doubt yeah, and I saw you guys one, two all the time. Mm -hmm. So going uh, on the whole shot, I watched. I, I didn't have a very good start that I wanted. I watched them creep away slightly. The downhill, I, I I took some chances. I didn't really ride the line. I rode some some worse lines, but got exactly where I wanted to. Had them in the sights the whole time. Uh, I was in third, moved into second, and just got on his wheel and just sat sat there the entire time, waited to see. He attacked me a few times on the climbs. Yeah. Um, Stayed with him in the single track, slowed down a little bit, and then, like I said, the last lap we hit the single track, and then I attacked him on the single track to keep the tension. Yeah. And it came to a sprint. Yeah, there were a lot of those today. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it was it's one of the fast courses. Yep, fast and fun today, that's yeah, for sure. Yeah, exactly. All right, thanks so much. Thank you.